Before starting this video, I have a small question to ask with all of you. Which company in the world is the largest fast moving consumer goods company by revenue? For your kind information, with a market capitalization of approximately 298 billion US dollars, it is the biggest food company in the world with the net sales amount to over 93 billion US dollars and it employs approximately 276,000 people worldwide. It has over 2,000 brands consisting of a wide range of food and beverage products across the globe. From infancy to adulthood, it has products for every Every aspect of life. And did you know friends, your favorite Maggie noodles and Kit Kat is also owned by this multi-billionaire company. Yes friends, you have heard right, it is none other than Nestle. Hello everyone, Namaste. I hope you are safe and secure. It's me Mayank Parma and you are watching Mankara. In today's video, we are going to discuss about the success story of Nestle and its powerful dominancy over its competitors all across the globe. Nestle's origin dates back to 1860s when two separate Swiss enterprises were founded that would later form Nestle. In the year 1966, Charles A. Page and George Page brothers from the US established the Anglo-Swiss Condensed Milk Company in Chan, Switzerland. In September in the same year, in nearby Wave, Henry Nestle, a German-born pharmacist, developed the baby food which is made up of cow's milk, wheat flour, and sugar. It was made for the infants who cannot be breastfeed. In 1867, Henry Nestle soon began marketing its product. In the same year, he also helped Daniel Peter in its milk chocolate manufacturing process. He prevented the problem of mild dew by removing all the water from the milk added to the chocolate. In the succeeding decade, both enterprises aggressively expanded their businesses throughout Europe and the US. In 1875, Henry Nestle retired, but the company under new ownership retained his name as Ferry Lacti Henry Nestle. By 1978, when both companies start selling rival versions of the other's original product, condensed milk and infant cereal, both firms expand sales and production abroad. In 1905, Nestle and Anglo Swiss has more than 20 factories and starts using overseas subsidiaries to establish a sales network that spans Africa, Asia, Latin America, and Australia. In the same year, Anglo-Swiss and Nestle merged to form the Nestle and Anglo-Swiss Milk Company. The First World War, which broke out in 1914, created demand for dairy products in the form of government contracts, which lead to increased demand for condensed milk and chocolate. To solve this problem, the company acquires processing and facilities in the US and Australia, and by the end of war, Nestle's production had more than doubled. As World War I ended, the firm benefits from the period of prosperity and becomes a global dairy company. After the war, military demand for canned milks declined, causing a major crisis for Nestle and Anglo Swiss in 1921. The company recovers but is rocked again by the Wall Street crash in 1929 which reduces customer purchasing power. However, the era carries many positives. The company's management corps is professionalized, research is centralized, and pioneering products such as Nescafe coffee was launched. By 1938, Nescafe is launched as a powder extract of pure coffee that retains coffee's natural flavor but can be prepared by simply adding hot water. In the same year, Nestle also felt the effects of Second World War Profits dropped from 20 million US dollars in 1938 to 6 million US dollars in 1939. After the US enters the wars, Nestle's brands rapidly gained popularity among American service personnel. Nescafe was also added in care and supplies in Japan and Europe. Ironically, the war helped with the introduction of the country's newest products, Nescafe which became a staple ring of the US military. Nestle's production and sales rose in the wartime economy. The end of World War II was the beginning of a dynamic phase for Nestle. Growth accelerated and numerous companies were acquired. In 1947, Nestle and Anglo-Swiss acquired Maggi by merging with Swiss company Elementana, which produces Maggi soups bullions and seasoning and is renamed Nestle Alimentana. Alimentana's history dates back to 1884 when Julius Maggi developed a protein-rich dried soup to tackle malnutrition. By the way friends, I've also made a detailed video on the success story of Maggi. So you can also go and watch that case study as well. The link is in the description box. Now let's get back into the topic. In 1948, the US Nestle Alimentana launches a soluble tea, Nest tea, which is manufactured using the same method as Nescafe and can be served both hot 
हॉट और कोल्ड इन 1954 नेस्ले इन्फेंट सीरियल वाज रीब्रांडेड एज सेरेलेक ओरिजिनली ओनली सोल्ड एज अ बुलियन क्यूब मैगी सीजनिंग ब्रांड फाउंडर इज आल्सो लॉन्च एज अ पाउडर इन द 1970स द कंपनी डाइवर्सिफाइज इनटू फार्मास्यूटिकल एंड कॉस्मेटिक्स बिकमिंग अ माइनॉरिटी शेयर होल्डर इन द ग्लोबल कॉस्मेटिक्स कंपनी लॉरियल बाय 1990स Nestle disposes of unprofitable brands and promotes those that satisfy increasingly health conscious consumers in line with its new nutrition, health and wellness ambition. The company expands in the US, Eastern Europe and Asia and targets for global leadership in water, ice cream and animal food. Nestle's relationship with India date back to 1912. When it began trading as a Nestle Anglo Swiss Condensed Milk Company Limited, importing and selling finished products in the Indian market, Nestle India manufactures products of truly international quality under internationally famous brands names such as Nescafe, Maggi, Milky Bar, Kit Kat, Bar One, Milk Maid, and Nestle. And in recent years, the company has also introduced products of dairy consumption and use such as Nestle Milk, Nestle Slime Milk, Nestle Dahi, and Nestle Jeera Raita. Now, Nestle business has expanded to beverages, waters, dairy, confectionery, pet care, even skin care. In 2011, it extended its leadership in nutrition, health, and wellness by creating Nestle Health Science to develop nutritional health care products that targets optimal brain health. Such innovation have helped Nestle address the global challenges of malnutrition, growing and aging population, and obesity. This same passion for nutrition triggers a commitment to improve products by reducing salt, sugar, and saturated fats. and fortify them with vitamins minerals vegetables and whole grains the covid-19 pandemic did not affect nestle negatively due to lockdown people bought more packaged food not only coffee and dairy products but also the pet products which increased the company's sales nestle is recording its strongest quarterly sales growth in 10 years it is the largest publicly held food company in the world measured by revenue and other metrics since 2014 it has over 400 factories in 86 countries and operates in 197 countries worldwide as nestle celebrates 150 years the company has stuck to its conviction that to prosper in the long term it must create value to for shareholders the community is where it operates and by the society the tagline of good food good life stands true for the consumers that was the story of nestle thanks for watching friends that was all for today and i hope that you have enjoyed watching this video if you have really enjoyed then please make sure that you like this video and also share this video with your friends and family members and if you are watching this video for the first time and you haven't subscribed to the channel yet then please make sure that you subscribe to the channel and also press the bell icon for the every updates of the new videos thank you thank you everyone <laughs>